If you want to set up a secure folder on Xiaomi 15 Ultra, then unfortunately it is not possible to use the same feature as you have, for example, on Samsung smartphones. However, we can still create a somewhat of a private folder or we can lock apps on our phone. So let's start with the private folder, how it looks like. Well, if we go to, for example, the files app by Google, then over here, if you scroll down, you should be able to find the save folder. So we can tap on it in order to choose a lock for our private data. But this includes uh, files. So for example, photos, videos, music, documents, and similar stuff that we can, for example, find in this app itself. So if I set up a simple pin code, there we go. Let's press got it. Now I can move files into that folder. So for example, I can go to images and over here I have my image that I just took and I can, for example, tap onto the picture, tap on these three dots in the top right corner, and then I can choose to move to save folder. And also I can press and hold my finger on the file and I can of course select multiple different files. And once again, I can tap on these three dots in the top right corner in order to move the save folder. Of course, we need to provide the password, press next, and the file is moved. So now if I go to the save folder and enter the password, then over here I will find all hidden files. So just photos, videos, like I mentioned. And of course we can remove something from the save folder as well by tapping on these three dots and then we can choose to move out. So if you want to set up a secure folder for apps, the only way without using third-party apps and the only way to do so is by using the app lock. So this won't hide any apps, just like in the case of secure folder, it won't hide any apps, but you will provide, you will set up the password for selected apps that you will have to enter in order to open them. Or you can also use fingerprint sensor or face unlock as well. So in order to set it up, we need to go to settings. Then we need to scroll down to apps. And then over here we have app lock. So we can tap on it, we can turn on, now we need to create the password for our app lock. So by default, we can use the pattern, but we can tap on a change password text over here in order to choose a different type. For example, the pin code or password. So I'm going to use pin. Once again, I'm going to set up an easy pin code. There we go. Uh, you might be asked to use Xiaomi account, which is convenient in case you lose password because you can recover your password with Xiaomi account, but we don't have to do this. We can press not now. And after five seconds, we can confirm our choice. But if you want to so feel free to use Xiaomi account. Then we have suggestions of apps that we can lock. I'm going to actually uncheck all of these. And I'm going to choose to use app lock. And right now I'm also asked to use my fingerprint. Of course, I can cancel this and not use it at all. And I'm going to actually use my fingerprint. So I can unlock apps with my fingerprint. And now here I can choose which apps should be locked. So I have Netflix locked and YouTube, and if I, for example, now try to open Netflix, I need to use my fingerprint or I have to use password. So this is another way to grant some privacy to your apps that you can access by using the password or by using biometrics. And that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching. Leave a like and subscribe to my channel and see you in my next videos. Bye.